a health advisory for sure in Martin County tonight. The excessive heat fueling more toxic blue-green algae. Among the advisories, a popular boat ramp in Indian Town with algae at a level 100 times more toxic than what is considered safe. WPTV News Channel 5's Kate Hussey tonight on the concerns in the days and the weeks ahead. A vibrant blue-green algae hugs the boat ramp here in Timer Powers Park. Not only is it so toxic we have to wear a mask, it's seeping closer and closer to Martin County's main waterway. Follow me. Walking along the edge of the Indian Town Marina, its owner, Scott Watson. I've owned and operated Indian Town Marina for 21 years. Shows us where he and his customers have seen that pesky blue-green algae. It comes and goes. Sometimes there's years we don't have it. And, you know, most, I would say probably 50% of the time I've seen it come and go over the years. Thankfully, by his marina, it's not too bad. We got a, a light haze of blue-green algae. But just about two miles down the canal at Timer Powers Park, that haze is much thicker and 100 times more toxic than what's considered harmful to humans. We knew that this year might be a very very big bloom and we're right here's the conditions perfect mark perry director of florida's ocean graphic society says he's not surprised with the extreme summer heat to see algae now on the c44 canal but it does mean the fears he's been preaching all summer are coming true we're concerned that this continues to go on downstream Perry says the Army Corps of Engineers recently opened the Port Mayaka floodgates and discharged nearly 9 million gallons of algae-laden water from Lake O into the canal to lower the lake while simultaneously fueling the blooms in the canal, now seeping ever closer to the St. Lucie estuary. As you get it further into the estuary, now you're exposing even more of that because there's more boating community, fishing community, there's more people live along the waterfront. With plenty more heat ahead and the possibility of tropical storms, Perry isn't optimistic. We're expecting this to be getting even worse. Yet Scott, nothing to get excited about, is clearly not concerned. He's survived blue green algae for 20 years and says he'll survive it again. Being on the water like I have here at Indian Town Marina for the last 21 years and out on the water constantly, it's, it's, it's cyclical, you know. In Indian Town, Kate Hussey, WPTV News Channel 5.